In the previous video, we learned to compare the weights of objects. In this video, we will learn more about it by some interesting examples. Bhola, Golu and Sher Khan are returning from the school. Sher Khan is walking fast. Golu is a little behind him and Bhola is following them both. Sher Khan asks Bhola, why is he moving so slowly? Then Bhola told him that his bag is the heaviest. So, he is moving slowly. Sher Khan said that his bag is the heaviest. Golu then told them that his bag was the heaviest. At that time, Barbole uncle was passing by. He saw all three friends fighting. When he asked the reason for their fight, he came to know that each one of them felt that his bag was the heaviest. Uncle told them that there is a way by which he can find out whose bag is really the heaviest. Uncle brought all three of them to his house. Uncle has a large weighing balance with him. Uncle also brought some balls. Firstly, Uncle placed Sher Khan's bag on one plate of the balance. Now, Uncle started placing the balls one by one in this way on the second plate. Uncle kept placing the balls on the scales until both sides of the scales came to the same position. The children could not understand anything. Uncle then explained them that when the two plates of the scales are on the same level, it means that the weight of the objects in both the plates is the same. When uncle counted those balls, he found that there were 13 balls in the plate. Do you know? What this means? It means that the weight of 13 balls equals Sher Khan's bag's weight. Now uncle took Sher Khan's bag from the scales and also removed the balls. Now on one side of the scale, uncle kept Bhola's bag and on the other side, started placing the balls one by one. Once again, both the plates reached the same level. But this time, there were 20 balls in the plate. Children, what does it mean? Yes! It means that the weight of 20 balls equals the weight of Bhola's bag. Now, uncle weighed Golu's bag with the scales. This time, when the plate came to the same level, there were 17 balls in the plate. This means that the weight of 17 balls equals weight of Golu's bag. Children, the number of balls equal to the weight of the bag of three friends is written here. Now, can you tell whose bag weighs the most? If you want, 
you can pause the video and find the answer. Well done! Your answer is absolutely correct. Highest number of balls is 20 balls and is equal to the weight of Bhola's bag. That's why Bhola's bag is the heaviest. And whose bag is the lightest? Exactly! Sher Khan's bag is the lightest because the number of balls equal to the weight of his bag is 13 which is the smallest number. Children, can you look at these scales and tell which of these two items is heavier? Yes, the water bottle weighs two balls and the tiffin box weighs one ball. So, the weight of the water bottle is more than the weight of the tiffin box. Uncle taught the children to compare the weight of items using weighing balance. Finally, Sher Khan and Golu realized that Bhola's bag was indeed heavier than their bags. Knowing this, Sher Khan and Golu told Bhola that they would carry his bag for some distance and help Bholu to lift the weight of his bag. Children, you must always help your friends too. Children, in this video, we learn to compare the weight of objects with some interesting examples. In the next video, we shall see some misconceptions that students do in the next video.